I've just finished watching uh, the creative one. That's uh, David's video for uh, Tech Survey 080808. Uh, he did a survey yesterday. I think his video was around 26 minutes or so, something like that. Quite a long video. Um, but what he's done is he's put up the survey for everybody else, so I've decided to actually respond. Um, and I'm looking at the questions here. This is uh, going to go all off the top of my head. Um, so what's the first one? What brand of computer do you have? Um, I have a Macintosh MacBook Pro, um, and it's the main brand that I use. But also I have, um, back in the UK, I have a PC which I built myself. So technically I've got both brands. Um, I've played around with Linux uh, University, but I don't own a Linux PC. Uh, what colour is the monitor? Bit of a strange question. Uh, well, it's obviously, for this MacBook Pro, it's uh, part of it, so it's an aluminium, so grey, silver-ish. Uh, what's currently on your desktop background? Let's have a look. Uh, just the standard Windows, uh, sorry, it's just the standard Mac uh, background, so it's all those lines and stripes of blue background. Um, how many icons are on your desktop? Well, what I normally do is I keep basically just one line of folders and then I organize it based upon that and subfolders and subdirectories. But it's been a busy two weeks, I've just basically thrown everything on and it's about 30 different icons on there, so <laughs> it's a bit of a mess. Um, what type of computer do you have? I have a Mac uh, and I have a Windows, but my parents technically have that, so just a Mac. Um, and uh, one thing I, I did pick up on, David didn't mention his iPhone um, as being, I, I, it is kind of, for me it would be a computer because it's, I mean, out and about I can see my emails, I can, uh, I can set calendar dates, I can make notes, etc. So it's kind of like a mobile computer for me. So I'd say my iPhone and my Mac. Um, do you have a printer? Uh, well, I, I do at home. It's a Canon IP4000 um, inkjet printer. Uh, scanner? Yes, I do have a scanner. It's a Canon. I can't remember what it is, though. It's been a while since I used it. Uh, good scanner. It's, it's one of those slim profile ones. You can stand up. Uh, do you have a digital camera? Yes, I do. It's a Canon um, XD400 uh, digital SLR. Do you have a webcam? I don't have a separate webcam. I've got the eyesight which is attached to the MacBook but I also have uh, a Panasonic uh, full HD camcorder, one of those small ones, I think there's another one of my videos where you can actually see that. Um, a microphone, it's inbuilt into this, I don't have a separate one, no, so hopefully the sound's pretty good on this. Um, what else? Favourite computer game has to be, and I'm ashamed to say, World of Warcraft because, well not really ashamed but it, it really did take over my life for about three and a half months and my, girl, my girlfriend can contest to that. Um, it's a very, very addictive game simply because of, the, because of the huge social aspect. So yeah, World of Warcraft is probably one of my favourite and also the original Halo. Um, I was very obsessed with that. Um, where are we up to? Do you have After Dark games? I'm not even sure what After Dark games are, so no. <laughs> What's currently in your recycle bin? Nothing. I've got this thing where as soon as something goes into the recycle bin, I have to empty my recycle bin because I don't like seeing the scrunched up paper inside the recycle bin. It's one of the, it's like a strange, strange uh, thing I have. Um, what internet service do you have? Uh, there's not one specific one here. It's uh, I think in Belgium, Telnet and um, EDP Net. We've got two different connections coming to this place. Um, how often are you on the internet? I'm on the internet at least 12 hours a day, um, partly because of my job and partly because, uh, I, well, like what else do you do other than waste your brain watching TV? So uh, the internet's a great platform for learning and a great place to find out new things. Um, so yeah, 12, 12, 13 hours a day. It's bad. <laughs> um, what is your favorite website? Google, because um, I basically use that as a spell checker. I know that. Um, using um, command space will bring up your spotlight where you can use the dictionary to find out words. Um, but I basically, what I do is I type the word into Google, do a search for it, and then it will throw me um, the actual correction, so did you mean, and then um, basically that's, that's what I use it for most really, and then obviously other websites I, I generally go to the ones I know about anyway. Um, do you like to go in chat rooms? No, never have, probably never will. Um, conferences, yeah, I have conference calls all the time. Um, web conference calls, Skype conference calls. So yeah, uh, what's about Yahoo or MSN? Not really bothered either way. Don't know. <laughs> Do you have AOL? Nope. Uh, I have AIM, uh, iChat. So it's 
kind of like the same aim protocol. They've also got aim on uh, the iPhone. So yes, I do. What's your current body icon? Uh, it is the icon for the Apple uh, iTunes App Store. So it's the uh, blue icon with the A in the middle. Um, how many people are on your buddy list? Uh, one, John Rettinger. Because <laughs> nobody else that I know uses AIM, everybody else uses Aaron's Head on Hotmail. So I just use that to speak to John. Uh, let's just scroll down here. Do you know how much to. Uh, blah, 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 how much to switch the hard drive and see you? Do you know how to switch the hard drive and CD wires around? Yes, I do. Um, I used to build PCs. Um, for, I had basically an internship in a, in a computer company. Basically, build a PC from the, from scratch, so from an empty case into something booted up and loaded, uh, working with XP. So uh, yeah, it was pretty good. So yes, I do know. Um, do you know how to fix compute when it breaks? Uh, that's a bit of a broad question. If I've seen the problem before, if the problem is easy to diagnose, or if it's somewhere online showing you how to fix it, then yeah. Um, I'm pretty tech savvy in terms of fixing computers, like I said, used to build them, so it, it shouldn't be too difficult. Um, even take one apart, yes, I can put one together, take one apart, um, hopefully it works when I do take it apart and put it together. Um, what's your current screensaver? It's just the uh, Mac Flurry, so it's the fuzzy uh, colours. <laughs> um, what does your screensaver, when does your screensaver come on? No idea. 15 minutes I think and then the PC goes to sleep uh, well the laptop goes to sleep 25 minutes not sure it's I'm mostly on it all the time so I never really see my screen so um, what's your volume is your volume control turned up uh, yes oh no it was four bars below the maximum so mm, kind of um, how many pushable buttons are on your computer in all well technically the keypad is pushable buttons um, and the clip at the front to open and close the lid is a pushable button but uh, I'm probably going to go with David as well um, well actually no I'm going to say the the power button like David said um, the trackpad button and the uh, the front button for the lid to clip open so three if you don't include the keyboard um, how many CDs for your computer do you have um, just one two three four I've got Office for Mac 2008, I've got the Leopard install disk, so I've got iLife 08, and Parallels, and Photoshop, CS3, and maybe something else, I'm not sure. Yeah, I think that's about it, so five or six. Um, do you have Wins yet? Nope. Well, not on the Mac, I've got it on the PC. Um, do you have Internet Explorer? No, although there is actually a version of Internet Explorer, I think it's like 5.6 or something for the Mac. Uh, but no, I don't. What I do have is a parallels partition on here, where, which is a Vista partition. And I know I'm going to get some people shouting in the chat now, uh, in the comments, saying, uh, why do you have Vista on a Mac? Uh, it's basically for, for my job, so it's to, to do some testing in case any of our um, clients need support which have uh, Vista PCs, so I, I get used to it. So I've got nothing against it, really. It's just on my preferred platform, Mac, because of my design background. Um, what else is there? Do you have Microsoft Word? Yep, Word 2008, Office 2008 for the Mac. Uh, do you have Paint Shop Pro? No, I've got the Creative Suite 3 design uh, premium package uh, student discount on that. So they give you a big student discount. The, uh, the only thing you're not allowed to do is make money off the designs that you make using the software. Uh, can you make graphics on your PC? Yes. Uh, do you have your own web page? Yes, johnfallakers.com. Um, that's co-founded with uh, John Rett and John Falake, as you probably all know him, if you don't look him up. Um, do you know HTML? Yes, I know how to meet ladies. That's a joke from John. Um, how about CSS? Yes, I do. Um, do you know JavaScript? Um, no. <laughs> I can read, the thing is I can read code um, and know what's going on, but I, I'm not very good at writing it, uh, just simply because of the way my head's wired. So, um, yeah, there's that. <laughs> this is a long survey. Um, how many web pages have you made? Altogether, probably 10 to 15 so far. It's, it's constantly going up. Um, I've lost my place now. Have you ever been warned through an IM? I'm not sure what that means. 
harassment. I don't know. No, I haven't done. But maybe I don't know. <laughs> Do you often get kicked offline for no reason? Kicked offline from what? My network connection drops sometimes. Uh, kicked offline? No. Sometimes in uh, Battlefield 2. Uh, but that's just to get a network connection. Um, so if you're laggy, you can't kill anybody, then your team drops you. Um, mm -mm -mm -mm. Have you ever been kicked offline for talking over and over again quickly? I don't know. No, I don't think so. <laughs> About how many emails do you get each day? Um, uh, personally wise, it's probably... I'm going to mute the TV. I totally didn't realise this was even on. Um, probably... 15 to 20 and then we've got our John Fall Acres email which John and I both look after so then that's probably 40 emails a day I'd say um, so not too bad uh, where am I do you get pop-ups not really occasionally I do if I'm using Firefox 3.0.1 uh, it does have a pop-up blocker just like um, Safari although it does let me through sometimes um, have you downloaded spyware? No, I'm on a Mac, but I have for my PC. Um, although Macs can get viruses, I'm not saying they can't, I'm just saying I haven't downloaded spyware, simple as that. Um, has anybody ever hacked into one of your online accounts? No, I have ridiculously secure passwords. Um, how many computers are in your house? This isn't my house at the moment, this is uh, my boss's place. Uh, and he has a 8-core Mac Pro, a Mac Pro G5, he has um, really too many things, he's got, he's got a MacBook Pro himself, um, he's got uh, G4 Cube, which is pretty awesome, um, and then he, he's like a Mac enthusiast like myself, so he's got loads of Mac stuff everywhere, so yeah. Um, where am I? Crap, that's my place. Um, what colour is your computer desktop? Blue. What colour is your computer chair? Uh, well, I don't really have any specific computer chair, although downstairs in the office we have uh, multicolored chairs, pastel colours, which is pretty cool. Um, are you a computer nerd geek? Both. Uh, I think I missed one. Wait. Do you have any stickers or have you drawn pictures on your computer? Not on this one, although um, I did on my PC that I built. Um, it was the, if, if any of you know, I think this is about maybe four or five years ago, probably five years. Um, what I did was I stenciled in and spray painted in the, um, what's, what's that, I've totally forgotten the name of it now. Um, well, if any of you know Games Workshop in the UK, or probably in America as well, Games Workshop is like figurine stuff. What they have is the Marines have like an eagle emblem. And I thought that was quite cool, so I spray painted that on the case, and it came out pretty cool actually. So yes, kind of. Um, ooh, I keep losing my place. What colour are your speakers? My speakers are see-through. Um, they are Harman Kardon Sound Sticks 2. Look it up on Google and you'll see they are pretty cool and they sound damn nice. Um, do you know the dimensions on your screen? 15.4 inch. That way, or so diagonally. Um, are you a computer nerd geek? Yeah, already answered that. Yes, to both, kind of. How much do you know about computers? Um, every, well, I'd be hesitant to say everything. Obviously, nobody knows everything. But I know enough, well, let's say, not everything, but say 98% of anything that, that you should know. I and mean, then obviously there'll be all those uh, terminal commands and things and then all, all the really, really nitty-gritty network things, which I, I'm not familiar with, um, but I can pick it up pretty quickly because I enjoy it. Um, what colour is your mouse? It's white, so it's the Mighty Mouse Wireless. Mm, how much do you know about computers? So that's not, not already been kind of asked. Oh, I've just read it twice, sorry. <laughs> um, does it have a ball at the end of it, or a red light? It is a laser mouse. Uh, what colour is the keyboard? Well, I've got the Apple Slim keyboard wired. I've also got these and they're both um, aluminium, so silver, but the Slim has white keys and this has silver keys, the MacBook Pro. Um, what's your favourite key in on the keyboard? Um, well, actually, I think you can actually find out yourself. If you look at the dirtiest key on your keyboard, um, then you'll actually know which one is...
your favourite. And according to my keyboard, it's the T. Um, T for Tommy. So, do you type fast? Yes. Uh, I speed type, touch type, and type backwards with one leg tied behind my back. If you can do that. Yes, I do. Um, how many pieces of paper are in your printer? I don't know, my printer's in the UK. Let's say it's full, so 75, I'm guessing. Um, that's a strange question. What does your mouse, uh, does your mouse have a little scroll to click the things? Strange questions. Uh, no, it, well, it doesn't have a scroll wheel, it has a, a nipple, um, as, as, the, as people call it, for the Mighty Mouse. And it's got, it's like one clicker with two sensitivity pressure, pressure sensitive things on the side, so no. Um, is your computer new or old? I'd be hesitant to say it's old, but it isn't new either. It's around about 12 months now. Um, is it really fast or slow? For a laptop, it's really fast. Um, 2.4 gig processor, 2 gig of RAM, plan to upgrade to 4 maybe. Um, does it freeze a lot? Mm, I've had it crash a few times, it doesn't freeze that often. Um, what does your cursor look like? Some black arrow. <laughs> Um, is there any music playing on your computer right now? No, because if there was, you'd hear it. Um, how often do you download and install things to your computer? Mm, that's, I don't know really. Um, let's say I download a program to test out and play around with once a week. Um, what do you call your computer? MacBook Pro, don't have a name for it. Would you marry your computer? Um, no. <laughs> um, I, I, jokingly, no, I would marry a Mac Pro 8 core, 3.2 gigahertz processor with 32 gigs of RAM and a couple of terabytes hard drive. Probably would, um, but no. <laughs> That's the end of the service. So yeah, I think this is this has gone on for like a crazy amount of time. Yeah, 17 minutes. So I've almost actually come up to, uh, to David's time. Um, so yeah, I'm going to cut it short now, obviously. Stop rambling. This is probably this is actually my longest video. Um, so if you get bored, just cut it off at any point. Um, so I hope you enjoyed yourself, and uh, by all means, either reply to this video, um, and I'll put a link in the, in the sidebar, uh, linking to David's tech survey, um, and let's see if we can get to people talking about this. See what uh, see what other people's answers are. Um, and see if we've got any interesting ones out there. Excellent. Thank you very much for watching, and speak to you soon.